Hello everyone, Dave here back again with another video and today we're going to take a look at Android 9.0 onto the Samsung Galaxy S7 and S7 Edge. So this is Linash OS which means that this is stock Android for the Samsung Galaxy S7 and the S7 Edge and it is working uh, perfectly fine. So one of the first things that uh, uh, are interesting is that there is adaptable theming all around the system. So for example, right now, as you can see, I have a white wallpaper and the settings application is white and as well as the app drawer. But if I set a dark wallpaper, for example, this one, everything onto the device is going to become darker. So you can see that right now the app drawer is dark as well as the settings application and the whole system user interface just uh, has dark colors right now. And you can also choose whether you want to match the wallpaper to match the theme UI or you want it uh, separately. So for example, you can set it white even if you have a dark wallpaper, which is uh, something really nice, but I choose to leave it uh, depending on the wallpaper. You have also time of the day, white or just dark. So the second thing I want to talk about are the animations. So the animations on this build are really fluid. So when I go to developer options, just slow them down so that you can see. So when I go to animation duration scale, I'm going to set it to 5x and I'm going to send a test notification so that you can see what the animation, for example, about notification is. So you can see how it just came out and it is going to go back right into the status bar, which is uh, something really nice. And all around the animations are really fluid, which is something really, really cool. So let me just uh, put them back to 1x. So for the rest of the video, you don't have to wait. So the next thing I want to talk about is uh, the battery life. So the battery life has been uh, really good when I go to um, settings battery. And over here you can see that I was fully charged the phone six days ago and I have screen on time of one hour and 11 minutes and I have 48% of battery left, wife left, which is something really good. This is not, not my primary device, uh, which is the reason why it hasn't been charged for the last six days. But uh, just uh, the standby time of uh, this build is uh, really, really good. And uh, the next thing I want to talk about is uh, how the notifications uh, are coming onto the walk screen so when you go to settings display and over here you have those when you receive a notification the device can wake up when you pick it up it can wake up and show you what are the notifications you can hand wave to the proximity sensor or you can just remove it from your pocket to see and you also have double tap to wake so i'm going to uh, demonstrate it really quick so you have double tap to wake and when you receive a test notification once again you can see that the device will uh, wake up to show you what the notification is and you have options depending on the application you can mark it as red reply or hide it so for example i'll just hide this one the next really cool thing is that you have a real face unlock so you can see down over here it just uh, unlocked because i just raised my head and uh, showed the phone uh, to me and you also have working fingerprint scanner and uh, basically this build is uh, really really nice and everything is working uh, really smooth on it. So typically for Pi you have the new recent apps and uh, the new gestures that uh, can uh, come with it and you also have digital way of being which just uh, basically tells you which application, what type of application you have been using. So for example, you can see games, others, wallpapers, and that I have used the phone for 19 minutes today. And uh, you also have this wind down options, which just basically disconnects your phone and uh, avoids any interruptions while you're sleeping so that you can uh, sleep better. When it comes to performance, these beauties are really, really good. So for example, I'll open uh, Subway Surfers really quick to show you that the animations are uh, working uh, flawlessly and that uh, there is uh, basically no change into the performance of the device so you can see that if we start if we start right now and i'm going to use one of those things because it is uh, animation intensive you can see that it is working uh, uh, really good which is something uh, really nice for uh, a build that is not actually made for this phone but it is uh, a stock android so this is it for this video. If you have any questions, leave them down into the comment section below. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.